sector, you were stepped on, say again, over. Captain, the small boat should be there shortly. Break, break, fly boat. Sector man, everyone one six five. Welcome to Howl Over Inlet Videos. If you're new here, welcome. And if you're not, welcome back. Enjoy. If you haven't shot the flares off, do not. We have your GPS position. There's no need for it. Um, but we're gathering information of where your family member is going and we'll relay as soon as we can. Over. Airbags, two pumps, plenty of dive tanks. We're heading to a 20 footer, I think it's a forward cutty with a bimini top and eastern shores. And it is capsized. We're going to try to just flip it over with two boats and pump it. But uh, if we need, we got our airbags. And one caught up. Yeah, one catching back up here. I think he recovered my hat. I lost my hat. I couldn't find it, oh, you couldn't find it. it yeah, I probably did. Why not right where you hit it? I passed it by a while. Busy weekend. Has been there this week. Yeah, yeah, I know. He doesn't have a, a motor on the boat. Just uh, by 163rd Bridge, Sunny Isles. It's supposed to be the second canal north of here. We have our sunk boat. <laughs> I need my bow line. That's fine. Can I give you this one? Just hook up to the bow for now. Or, or grab that line, undo that one. See if you could work on the two bow lines. Yeah, and then you're gonna tow it from the one that's already hooked to the D-ring. Just, just drag it out right now for this, because I'm untying it. Because I don't want my tow line in my hand. It's just easier. All right, here, well, give me... To hook up and then re -hook up again. All right, all right. I got gotcha. you. No jokes, Brian. All right, I got gotcha. you. I need to push forward. All right, well, then hook me up. Here. Okay, yeah. No, sorry, watch your hands. How big is the forward cutty cabin? It's a big cutty. No, the cabin. 
The, the cabin. It's tiny. It's very small. Or, like sometimes they're sometimes they're hard to flip over. I'm gonna hunt. I'm gonna cut this rope. This little one. Yeah, he says it's okay to cut the rope. That micro tech don't drop that in the water. All right, she should be free now. A little windy out here. There were two anchors that were holding it, but it's the same size string that was holding it in the boat. I think you can just pull them right on. Appears to be free, let's see. It appears to be free. It appears to be free, yeah. Let's keep on rolling with it, see if it gets hung up. Blow your mic as well. Okay, can you hear me now? Yes, yeah, way better. didn't work. Brian's gonna put a line on the back of it and uh, pull it on one side while I am pulling forward to do the trick. See how high the D-rings are? Yeah, but if you go across the phone. Ah, oh, you're funny. Anyways, the see if you go there, it's just gonna go under the engine and you don't really have an ideal pulling angle. Okay. If there's a cleat and you keep it in front of the transom, then we got the max rotation. Keep it in front. All right, so I'm gonna pull forward. Don't let it go back. Oh, really? All right, let me get out of your way. All right, here we go. Bryant is going to pull. Let out more line. All right, that looks about right. I got it, I got it, I got it. Stay, stay, stay. Uh. Bro, I'd be better off by myself just doing it. You hand me the line. It's not that hard, you use the sh line possible. It's not gonna work, dude, that you gotta focus. Dude, come on. You should let me be the back boat. I could do this all easy. Dude, get away from the boat. Don't pop the tubes. All right, he let the line get behind the transom like he shouldn't have, like I warned him about. And that's what happens. Try it like that. Here, take over. I'll do the back boat. Take over. Here, take over me. But well, you're the one who wanted the back boat job. All you gotta do is walk it around. Walk it around by hand. I'm gonna show you how easy it is. Okay. 
Here, here, go, go, go. You want to just go straight? Just go that way a little more, yeah. Nice and easy, nice and easy, and we got it. Nice and easy. I'm slacking off. All right, I recovered this line. I'm gonna take it on my bow. Captain Bryant did a good job, uh, tried to do a good job rolling it, but kinda had to help a little. No problem. I'm gonna toss all this line back in the boat so we don't lose it. Looks like we're dragging some lines, but that's all right. It's gonna match the speed of this vessel here. Oh, actually gotta turn into it a little. Stay straight. All right, we're draining some water at the moment, but I'd like to Get the gunnels a little higher out of the water. I could probably do that just by stepping on it with my body weight. But for now, just getting it stabilized. I'm currently detached from the vessel. And I'm gonna see what we can do here. I'm just gonna put this line up here so it doesn't get in the way. All right, now what if I keel it? the dangerous and fun part of connecting to the moving boat. In the windy Better end of this line here at the end. I am virtually leaving my boat unattended right now. My engine pumps out, I'm in trouble. And I'm here. Alright, now I'm secured. anchor chain it must be an anchor oh there's an anchor come on baby there we go all right looks like I'm gonna be able to throw my pump in here we gotta clear some space out open this hatch come on baby open oh there we are oh that's enough plastic to Clog the pump pretty good. Let's get this all out of the way as much as we can. Clog that intake hose. All right. We are ready for plan. The next part, the phase. We're gonna be pumping her out. Protect her for the sun. Discharge hose. Discharge can wedge right between here, should be alright. That'll keep it pinned. Intake hose going to the lowest part of the vessel, which I just exposed access to. Alright, we should be good to start pumping. Gonna fire this baby up. Hope she goes. One quarter throttle, choke. Heels on, full choke. Oh no. See, that's a problem. We just lost our discharge. So. I can grab one off the other boat. We're probably just going to try to wing it out the side.
I'll kick out the side. And hope I don't get too wet. Plastic bags in this boat. They're all clogging our strainer. 